Today we're going to be testing the most illegal Minecraft mods. And the first mod we're going to be testing is called an Enderman. That is weird. I don't know what that means. I'm kind of terrified. It has 13 downloads. I'm going to go into creative mode before we just get wrecked. And yo, let's try and find this thing. I don't know. Oh my gosh, it's so dark. Okay, there we go. Can we find this stupid Enderman? I see a bunch of regular mobs. Does he spawn on his own? Or do we have to summon him in? It's the first mod guy. Oh my god. I was going to say it's the first mod. How illegal can it get? Look at this nerd. Wait, why is he actually super terrifying? If I do difficulty peaceful they do despawn okay well in that case let's disable mob spawning and then if i search up enderman oh my god yeah we have an enderman that is weird spawn egg now we should be able to only summon these guys okay there was like a few of them so they spawn like apparently one to five in groups i don't like how they're moving okay are we really gonna fight this thing bro i think we have to i'm gonna give myself a diamond set there you go boom 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 i'm gonna enchant our sword to sharpness one let's grab a few golden apples listen just your basic stuff i am gonna grab a few pearls just in case I need to escape from them and a shield. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Okay, I think we should be good. Maybe some few blocks and survival mode. Okay, where are they? Oh my god, is that one up there? Wait, he can go through blocks? Hold on a second. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, I didn't even look at them. They're not passive, they're not passive, they're not passive, they're not passive. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay, you know what? I ain't scared. I ain't scared. Oh my goodness. Wait, what? I thought I killed them. Why did he go all sideways and stuff? Oh, what? What is going on? Okay, okay, hold on. They're not doing that much damage. Hold an apple. Come on, come on, come on. Die, nerd. Come on, come on. Oh my gosh, they just literally like will weave an attack. Oh my god, they do so much knockback. Help, I'm scared. Dude, what is their hitbox, gamers? I'm not gonna lie, they're so hard to hit. Let's enable hitboxes again. There you go. Oh, I see now. How about when they go down? Does that change? It does. They literally can wait. No, it doesn't. It's like a trick. Oh my gosh, dude, I haven't killed one yet. I haven't killed a single one yet. How do they have so much health? They do like less damage than a regular Enderman, I guess. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, okay. But they attack such in sync, it's so hard. Okay, no. Nope. Disabling the hitboxes. I killed one. I killed one. Wait. Whoa. We got multiple pearls. Oh my gosh. Yeah, they dropped multiple pearls. That's so interesting. And when they die. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, they don't drop the pearls instantly. They plop out of the ground. Okay, this is so weird. This is good aim training, though. I feel like my aim has to just be like insane to slaughter them, please. I do what? I'm getting thrown around. I'm actually gonna die. I'm actually gonna die. I'm actually gonna die. No, no, no. There's only one left. There's only one left. I'm smack. I'm clicking him, bro. Oh, we did it. But of course, he dropped two balls, which is probably probably the least illegal thing. Yoink. Let's go. All right. What a way to farm some ender pearl. I hated that. Now we have a mod called the cleaner's toolkit. Do I look like a maid? Don't answer that. But apparently we're going to need to get ourselves a crafting table and craft ourselves some soap. I think this is going to work. I don't think it matters which candle we get, but let's get some pink dye and a water bottle, I believe. And just going like that. Oh my God. We get soap. <laughs> Wait. Okay. So what do we do with this? I think if we grab any block that's like mossy. No way. How about infested stuff? Okay, hold on. I'm gonna place this down, and if we try and clean it... Wait, what? Wait, that's actually kind of cool. So now it's soap. You can just right-click the mossy blocks. Wait, what? This is low-key kind of cursed. Huh. I don't know what I expected soap to do, but I guess that makes sense. I think if we grab some iron and sticks, we can also make something called a hammer. Wait, okay, what does this do? I think anything that's cracked, it'll just, like, fix by just right-clicking. Oh, my goodness. Honestly, kind of satisfying. Yeah. Yeah, I'm fixing everything. I'm Bob the Builder or Bob the Fixer. And I'm a little bit confused, but if we get something like this, a dispenser and a water bottle, we get bug repellent. Wait, what? What does this do? Does it work on chickens? Okay, it doesn't work on chickens. It could work maybe on spawners or... Oh my God, there's two mob spawners right here. I don't know if it's gonna work on spawners, but let's try. Okay, no, it doesn't work. How does this work? Do I just throw it on? Or does it only work on the infested blocks? No way it only does the infested blocks that have... Oh. Oh. So you're telling me all it does is just de-infest the blocks that were originally infested with silverfish? Wow, so cool. Now we have a mod called Snowball Arsenal. And honestly, I love illegal snowballs. And look, there's a beautiful village that we can destroy. Actually, I don't know if these snowballs are gonna be explosive. Never mind. Snow bomb, spike ball, slush ball. Wait, I don't think all of them are, oh my God, called snowball. This one's called spiked ice ball. This is 100% illegal. Okay, I'm actually kind of terrified. And this one's just called ice ball. I don't know which one is like the craziest. I feel like we can try them out in this order. And so, okay, the ice ball, pretty sure this is illegal. What 
does this do? Oh my god, it just one shots mobs? Okay, wait a second. Yo, this is crazy. Hello, polar bear. Oh my goodness. Dude, this thing does so much damage. You can just spam it. How overpowered is this? Oh, wait, you can only stack it one at a time. So it's really only that great in creative mode. And I don't see the iron golem. I think bro's hiding. Bro does not want to get snowball. Oh, there he is. Mohammed, no, I mean, no, I mean, no. Wait, what the? I can pull it back? Whoa, I can pull it back and it does more damage? I didn't even know that. Oh my gosh, it's like a bow, but it's a snowball. Dude, how is this thing about to die from just using a freaking frozen snowball? I mean, it's made of ice, so yeah, I guess that is pretty uh pretty deadly. But now we have slush ball. Okay, does this... Oh, wait, what? It just freaking spawns water? I mean, honestly, this is like not bad for griefing. <laughs> yeah, take this village. Listen, it's not lava. It's not that bad. However, the spike ball, I feel like this thing is gonna be even more deadly than before. It doesn't seem like it's actually as strong as the other one. Yeah, it doesn't even one shot a pig, so this one kind of sucks. But now we have snow bomb and spiked ice ball. I have a feeling the snowball one is probably the best, so I want to test it on another bald man. Okay, wait, this does do a lot of damage. Can I hit myself with it? If I go into survival mode, do I get like one shot? Is this even gonna work? Oh my gosh! Wait, did I get hit from the freaking iron golem or like my spiked ball? I don't even know. Okay, let's try that again. Yeet. Wait, it just broke. Okay, and it's about to land. It's about to land. Give me it! Oh my god, we almost died. Okay, so you can hit yourself, which is so weird. That makes sense though. If you do that in real life, it's gonna hurt. Alright, I'm gonna go in creative mode and now let's test out the snow bomb. Yeet! Wait, what? It didn't do any. Oh my gosh! So if it hits a mob, it doesn't explode, but if it does hit like the terrain, it's basically like a piece of TNT. That is so weird. And oh, this village is actually kind of nice. I feel bad. Psych. But our water low-key protected it a little bit. <laughs> Imagine you're playing in the snow, your friend hits you in the face, and you come back with a snow bomb. Gamers, I don't think I have to say don't try that at home. Or in the battlefield of the snow fighting. Or in any snowball fight. Boom! Yeah, you might blow up your village IRL. And for the next mod, it's called the meat update. It has 33 downloads, gamers. We're gonna be the 34 victim. What? Is this the meat biome? No. What is this, bro? No, what is this, bro? Oh my god, the sky turns red. The sky turns red. What is this? Meat tree? Ew! I called it! I didn't even know! Bro, oh my god. Wait, I actually don't like it. I don't like it at all. Is this a random bone block? Holy crap, I just realized. Oh, this block is meat. What? What? Okay, there's regular stone. There's regular stone in the meat in the meat thingy, my bob. But I guess dirt is bones, and this is what does that say? I'm not even gonna say that out loud. That is so gross. These are flesh blocks. Oh no, wait. If I go into survival mode, okay, okay. I thought maybe, like, I don't know. You can't even make planks from the meat tree, bro. Honestly. And why do magma cubes spawn here? That is so weird. I can't sprint. Wait, yo, it's like soul sand. It's like soul sand. You can't move fast. It's slower than soul sand. Oh no, what is this? Ew, why does it sound like that? Meat leaves. Why is there no space? Okay, this mod is actually terrifying. This 100% is gonna get you banned if you download this. It looks like there's normal ores and stuff. Nah, fam, this is actually disgusting. Disgusting, bro. And it turns the normal trees white as, lo as long as they're inside of here. Dude, and the why is the, why is the water like white? What is this, bro? There's random like pockets and stuff. I don't, I don't, I don't understand this at all. I actually just don't understand this at all. Unfortunately, gamers, we're gonna be testing this mod. And by testing, apparently we can go... Hold on a second. I'm just gonna make this portal look as aesthetically pleasing as it possibly could. Made out of flesh. Apparently, if we light this up with a flame steel... Oh, it doesn't work. Okay, wait. Maybe it has to be like full, like meat. Like that. Okay, wait, what? If I search a meat... Oh, no. What is this? Meat plant? Meat dimension portal igniter? Ew! Yeah, ew's right. What even is this thing? It doesn't do anything. Oh my gosh, the portal. No. No. Why is there hearts coming out of it? Dude, this looks like a three-year-old made it. No offense to any three-year-olds watching. Arrow of M. Eat potion? Meat potion? What? What does that even do? What does a potion of meat do? It doesn't do anything. Hold on a second. Survival mode? Okay, what? Maybe it heals you? I, I don't know why it would. Do we get any new weapons? I don't even see anything. Oh, ew. Yeah, wait. We get some bone armor. Oh, okay. I mean, that's actually not even that bad. It looks kind of cool. It looks pretty strong too. Yeah, I think it's better than diamond. Ayo. Hey, oh my god, there are meat tools though. Wait, what? The sword does seven attack damage and you can spam it? The bone axe doesn't even let you break the tree better. I'm so confused. How about the bone pickaxe? Okay, the bone pickaxe is low-key mid. Ew, wait a second, but you need it. Or I guess mining these flesh blocks with a pickaxe drops. What does it drop? Just meat? It says human chunk. Oh my god. Okay. This is actually the grossest thing ever. I'm actually so confused. Maybe the bone shovel? Okay, the bone shovel doesn't even, like, do it faster. And the bone hoe is just useless. Zero attack damage, by the way. Alright, you know what? Let's just go through. Oh no. This is terrible. I'm in the flesh dimension. Oh no. 
no, dude, I actually hate this. I actually really hate this. The only mob that spawns seems to be the stupid magma cubes. Okay, hold on. Are, are there any dungeons or something? No, everything is purely me. Ew, wait, why is there mine shafts? No, that means like some living beings at some point lived in this dimension. I hate this. I, 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 don't, I don't like this at all. Okay, wait a second. There's some freaking... Whoa, wait. You can find diamonds in here though? Hey, yo. I hear some spiders. What the? I guess it's like a normal mine shaft. Maybe this used to be a normal world, but the human flesh meat stuff just took over. Okay, no, this is disgusting. And it looks like, yeah, okay, there are giant caves. There is lava. The lava's unaffected, but wait, what the heck? Yo, this water does not look the same. It's completely transparent. And Loki looks like saliva. Ugh! Okay, I hate this dimension. This is sinful to have entered this place. This is the real nether. The nether is heaven compared to this, bro. Get me out of here, please. Kill me. Come on, please tell me I respawn out. Oh, thank goodness. And the next mod is called 100 and tiny spiders. Oh no, I'm really gonna regret this, but apparently gamers, I'm gonna give myself just a stone sword. Hey, little spiders. I'm a little bit scared because apparently when you kill a spider, well, you know what? I didn't even know. Let's just see what happens. Hey, spider. Listen, I don't kill you guys in real life, okay? I'm actually quite nice to you spiders because I know you kill mosquitoes and you're really good for the environment, blah, blah, blah. But uh, in Minecraft, <laughs> Minecraft's not real life. Okay, why isn't it spawning? Why aren't there no freaking spiders spawning from this? Oh, maybe it's because of the lava? Well, in that case, we just gotta find any spider. It doesn't have to be that spider. Hello, spider. Hey, Mr. Spider. I was looking for one of you. Oh my God. Okay, okay, okay. We got this. We got this. I ain't afraid of one spider. I could take down a spider at any point, but I'm kind of scared to kill him. All right, no, who cares? Three, two, one. Boom, bap. Oh my God. Ah! Oh my gosh, that's terrifying. No, 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 no. What, what, what? I can't even hit him. I can't even hit him. Oh, wait, what the? What just happened? Okay, somehow that was more terrifying than the last like flesh mod we just did. So there's another spider there. So apparently, I guess when you kill spiders now with this mod, it summons a bunch of tiny ones as they do in real life sometimes. Oh my gosh, no, I can't handle the creeper. I can't handle the creeper and all the freaking... Okay, they just got me. And the final mod is called Donut Kingdom. Yo, that sounds pretty nice. So I guess... Oh, there's a second page. Donut mod add-ons. Holy crap. We got donut. An a a another thing called donut. It's a block. I think when you mine this, it drops donuts. Okay. I gave myself hunger to eat these donuts. Let's see what happens. Oh, it just gives me a piece of sugar every time you eat it. That's actually not too bad. I maybe it has good saturation. Okay, but the real thing is that there's... Wait, what is that? Multi-tool uses to break golden donuts? Hey, yo, wait. Gold donuts. Yo, this is sick. So apparently somewhere you can find these golden donuts. I think it's in a donut dimension. And eating these give you insane effects. Well, it doesn't seem like they last very long. I guess because it's fast food or junk food. But you can only mine the golden donuts with this certain pickaxe, I believe. And yeah, you need the multi-tool, I guess. There's a donut kingdom key. Oh my god, there's hot chocolate. Wait, we gotta get to the donut dimension. I believe we just go ahead and make a bunch of donut block like this. Like a portal. Donut portal. Use the key. And it can take us to the donut dimension. Okay, wait. This is gonna be sick. This is pretty cursed. I'm not gonna... What the heck? What's a donut king? Hey, yo. Alright, no. I'm getting my donut golden armor. Wait, you can make golden donut armor? Okay, that's pretty cool. There's a fire wand. An advanced fire wand was this? Whoa. Wait a second. I think it just shot like a homing fireball. Yeah, it's going to a specific entity. I see them. They're underground. Hey, yo. Hold on. Hold on. We're gonna have to go down. What? This is the Donut King? Why does he look so terrifying? Oh my god. And they spawn everywhere. Oh my god. Oh my god. Take this. Yeah, that's right. I got a donut wand or a fire wand. I don't even know how that makes sense. No, no, no. We're gonna need to give ourselves some better stuff. I don't know if chocolate bars do anything, but I'm gonna give myself them. Hot chocolate and white chocolate bucket. And I guess some basic tools. Oh, yo. And a bunch of these donuts. All right. Ain't no way I'm dying. I think these are actually like ingots that you use to craft stuff. Hold on. We gotta kill one of these donut kings. There's so many of them. Die, you fool. Okay. He's immune. He's completely immune. So am I, I guess. Take the white chocolate. Okay, the white chocolate doesn't do anything. Oh my god, they're after me. Eat this, eat this, eat this, eat this. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Wait, I did damage to one of them. I can see one of their boss bars here. Oh my god, there's so many. There's so many. There's so many. Come on. I killed one. Wait, they dropped diamond gear? Hey, yo. All right, hold on. I'm gonna just chug these. I'm gonna chug these and bop, 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 bop. Yeah, get wrecked, nerds. So we can tell when we kill one when, yeah, there you go. Lightning strikes. It looks like they just dropped a random piece of damaged gear, which honestly, yo, if you make a farm out of these, right, they could be really useful, I feel like. There you go. We killed another one. We got a golden donut from killing one. Interesting. Oh my god, dude. Wait, why do they just keep spawning though? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna do FX give bionic strength. Yeah, infinite. Oh, I just died. I was typing too slow. I didn't even notice before, gamers. It looks like, yeah, there are two different types of donut blocks. These are the golden ones. Wow. Wait, so, I mean, it's not like the golden donuts are that rare then. And oh my god. What? Why is there a villager? I guess normal structures still summon here. Wait, this is the most illegal thing I've 
ever seen. Bro, we just found a village. And yo, a shipwreck. Actually, Loki, a shipwreck kind of makes sense. But it's just stuck in the hot fudge. Bro, what is this man? And if we go underground, oh my god. Wait, lower into the hot fudge? It looks like there's white chocolate fudge or whatever. There's two different types of liquid. Okay, that is super cursed. And wait, I, I'm not finding any more land. Oh my god, this is the worst thing ever. What is this, bro? Why is there a snow village trapped in the middle of nowhere in a sea of hot fudge, bro? This is so crazy. This looks like an arc in one piece. I don't even know how to explain what we're finding right now, gamers. This is illegal. Honestly, though, not the worst dimension. I feel like if I was trapped here, I'd have a lot of fun and never go hungry. Actually, I'd probably die of malnutrition because you just can't eat donuts forever. And it doesn't look like the villages actually spawn. Wait, what is this? Huh? Why is this tree an azalea tree with hay? Is this a natural thing? Dude, I'm so confused. I was going to say they don't spawn natural food, but I think they do. Okay, but this place is honestly an enigma. There's a desert village in the middle of nowhere in the donut dimension. All right, you know what? I don't think it's going to get more illegal than that. And oh my God, so many donut kings spawn here. Wait, I wonder if we summon the donut king. Oh my goodness. Wait, who's going to win? Who's going to win? Oh, wait, what? Bro got wrecked. All right, I guess the donut king. So much for being a donut king. But if you guys enjoyed today's video, subscribe. I'll see you in tomorrow's banger. Peace.